Let me show you something about Jesus. Jesus, he had ministry that he did in the meantime. Turn to your neighbor and say, neighbor. Meantime. Well, he did the ministry in the meantime while he was on to his way to the big time. Everybody say big time. So you got meantime ministry and then you got big time ministry. Some people want to skip over the meantime and go straight to the big time. But you ain't ready for the big time unless you've been through the meantime. Some people want to start right in the shower, singing from the shower to go on the Broadway. No, you got to start in, in, the, in the shower, then come out in the bedroom. Don't go all the way out on the street. Come out in the bedroom. Then you may come in the living room. You got to start in the meantime before you get to the big time. Let me put another window in. Jesus was walking uh, by the way and he met a man named Jairus. And Jairus said, I want you to come to my house and heal my daughter because she's sick so Jesus said I'm going to Jairus's house but in the meantime as I mean a woman with the issue of blood touched the hem of his garment she was not where he was going his objective was the house of Jairus but on the way a woman touched his garment that changed her life stop overlooking the people you can change on the way stop overlooking the miracles that can be changed on the way I don't know how many people Jesus blessed just by passing by a lame man jumped up just because he passed by blind people saw just because he passed by lepers got cleansed just because he passed by and they were just the meantime ministry Meantime, it takes proficiency. 